right back at you. Right now we're in the lobby. It got so hot and busy in the VIP party. We had to step out into the lobby. Right now I'm being joined with the beautiful, adorable Miss Michelle Boxel Gleason, one of the hottest fashion stylists, hairstylists, makeup artists in the business. Tell us a little bit about yourself, Michelle. Thank you very much. My name is Michelle Boxel Gleason, and I'm a celebrity makeup artist and hairstylist. Well, tell us about some of the celebs. I kind of already know a couple, but I want to hear from you who you uh, were able to do hair and makeup for. Thank you very much. I've actually had the honor of working with Brock and Michelle Obama and Michelle's brother, Craig Robinson. And I've worked with a lot of celebrities like Dakota Fanning and, oh gosh, you name it. A lot of famous comedians that come into town. And so it's busy all the time. Wow. How was it working with the president and the first lady? It was a great experience, actually. That really set my career on the map. And how, did, how did you get plugged up with that gig? I was actually recommended from Channel 2, which is KATU, mm -hmm. and they recommended me to Good Morning America, which is also the ABC uh, affiliate, and they, they're the ones, uh, they got a call, actually, uh -huh. and they called me and asked if I could do their hair and makeup and, when they were in town, so... That's awesome. That is so cool, man. So how were they in person? Were they as cool as they seem in person? Oh, definitely. Yes. They were just, you know, in my director's chair like all of my clients are. And I treated them like a VIP as I would anybody else and very charismatic, very down to earth. And Michelle's brother um, is from here. He lives here. Right, so, right. Um, so they knew a little bit about Oregon. So it was great. Wow, that's sweet. Well, if you bump into him again, Toba Rock, I said what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> so Michelle has also won several awards. Um, you won year before last and you won the year before that. Tell us a little bit about those awards. Sure. The a year before last, I won Best Makeup Artist. And then this last year, I won Best TV and Film Hairstylist. And then this year, I'm up for Best Makeup Artist and Best Hairstylist. That is so great. That is so great. So make sure you guys vote. If they want to vote for you out there, tell them how they can vote for you. Definitely. Go to voteboxall.com, and boxall is spelled B-A-U-X-A-L.com. And if someone wants to hire you for your wonderful services, Michelle, how can they get a hold of you? Definitely. My website is boxall as well, so it's B-A-U-X-A-L.net. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Stay tuned for much, much more, and we'll definitely see Michelle at the Portland Fashion and Style Awards coming up November 9th at the Portland Arts Museum. Stay tuned for much more. J-Max signing out. Peace. <laughs> that is so cool, man. I didn't know you. Oh, you missed that. <laughs> I said a little nibble won't hurt anyway. <laughs> oh, man. Having some fun. It's a great night. Having a blast. Having such a blast. Now tell us, Michelle, about the pageant that you were just at. I heard that was a real big deal for you, and you also won something down in Atlanta. Oh my gosh, it's been a journey of a lifetime, actually. The last nine months, I've been reigning as Ms. Oregon Plus America, wow. and so I actually had the privilege of going to Atlanta, Georgia, two weeks ago, and competing at nationals, and I have won third runner-up. Third runner-up. She's the third best in the whole United States of America, ladies and gentlemen. This is the one that you want doing your hair and makeup, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. It was, yeah, it was an experience of a lifetime, something I've never done. I'm normally behind the scenes taking care of my clients, where this time I had to go on stage and really just put myself out there, and this year I really hope to um, achieve the title of Mrs. Oregon Plus America, and I'll be able to go to nationals yet again next year. Well, we're going to be rooting for you, Michelle. Let me ask you this. Do you ever get nervous? I mean, because you, you, you got people, folks from all around the nation that are competing with you at these events. Do you ever, like, get nervous and uh, maybe give somebody, a, oh, I cut too much or, dang, I took too much on her eye. Do, does that ever happen or you just keep your cool? No, I don't think I ever get nervous. I'm more anxious than anything, uh, but especially when it comes to pageants being on stage, and it's it can be nerve-wracking having judges sure. sitting there judging you, and, right. and it's a whole other ball game. But when it comes to clientele sitting in my chair, I never get nervous, ever. She got the poker face, y'all. She's the truth, and she's one of the great ones in this industry. So stay tuned for much, much more. Once again, if they want to get a hold of you, Michelle, how can they get a hold if they want to hire you to do hair and makeup? Oh, definitely. It's boxall.net, B as in boy, A-U-X-A-L.net. Stay tuned for much more Dozen Magazine exclusive. It's your guy, Jay Mack, broadcasting live. VIP parties going on for the Portland Fashion and Style Awards. I'm going to go back inside and see what's happening. So I'll catch y'all in a minute. Stay tuned. One love. <laughs> <laughs>